about three months ago I did a video on the rodeo when we were in Tamarindo and everybody who knows about the rodeos from there and watched the video told me you just wait till the rodeo comes to Kobano. Well, tonight's that night and I have sneakers on so let's see what happens. Are you guys excited for the rodeo? We are. I love it so far. Pretty much guaranteed some serious madness tonight. I hope so anyway. Kara, are you excited for your first ever rodeo? Yeah, I am excited. Yeah? Yeah. You've never been to one before? Not a real one, no. And this is about as real as it gets. For now, yeah. Okay, so I'll be the first to admit that the rodeo footage wasn't really up to, uh, I don't know, I guess what I thought it was going to be. However, there was a lot of people there, there was a lot of people in my way, and uh, I tried to move, I tried to get in front of the thing, police officer moved me away, you know what, it was just a pain in the ass. But anyway, we got some clips, we had some fun, Ben and I went in and uh, we were kind of in there with the bulls, not really. We weren't one of the ones that were running around with it the whole time, but you know, it was still kind of cool. Anyway, it's a nice day today, it's Sunday. We're in Montezuma, we're gonna check the waterfall out, jump off the waterfall cliff thing, and uh, just hike in, have fun. So let's see how this goes. So if you watch my last Montezuma waterfall hike in video, You'll remember that I did it barefoot and it was one of the worst experiences of my life. But today, not barefoot baby, I got some hiking boots on. However, what I did do today was not wear socks and I made a mistake because I'm 50 feet in and I have, think I have blisters already. Awesome. So the whole rodeo thing was actually super packed. Uh, kind of makes the at-home exhibitions look like child's play, to be honest. Tons of people, tons of vendors, tons of rides, all kinds of cool stuff. Same cotton candy, though. Exactly. 
exactly the same. Last time we came through here, it was rainy season. So uh, I think there was a lot more water, but not, not much more than there is right now. And uh, it was definitely not as nice. Even though rainy season is, is a lot more green than it's supposed to be like this time of year. Uh, it's really beautiful right now, but still pretty nice. Lots of people here this time of year though. So since the theme of most of my videos these days has to do with mistakes, um, I'm reminded as we're walking through here that the last time I came, I did leave my flip flops in the middle of the jungle and went barefoot and continued on. So today's lesson is when you visit Montezuma waterfall, just wear some shoes or some really good flip flops because it sucks and we just got passed by a dude wearing a helmet so i don't know i don't know what's up with the guy but he was just walking wearing a helmet so maybe it's that dangerous that you should be wearing a helmet and here's the other major difference over rainy season and summer season that's the most amount of people i've ever seen here tons of people here today no big deal but there's a big difference
Oh, no, right? I want to try to get a better one before I just get completely free. It's so hard to get up on that waterfall. Really? So hard, dude. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't breathe. So getting up on the waterfall was way more difficult than I thought it was going to be. If it wasn't for the one dude who took the GoPro from my hand and the other dude that helped me up, I'd still be over there slipping and sliding trying to get up. The water might not look that powerful, but it's pushing you down the whole time and it's like, it's equivalent to standing in the shower with your face facing the shower head the entire time. You literally are just breathing water in. Super fun, super unique shot and cool to be under there, but it was super difficult. <laughs> really fun though, but I think it's time for these guys to do it. No? shower with your face right in the shower, eh? I could barely even open my eyes. <laughs> what did you think of the waterfall? I thought it was fun. That was probably the best part. It was really fun. Inside the waterfall? Yeah. <laughs> cool. So that was super fun in the summertime. Definitely a cool place to go to hang out. You can hang out here all day. Hot, water's refreshing, super fun. You've got ropes, you can jump off cliffs, and you can almost drown while you're trying to climb a waterfall. So totally worth it. Highly recommend it. There we go. What's happening? What are you saying? Oh, what's up, Pura Vida? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you guys are back from the cold weather, hey? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah. we got our fix and we're like, we are happy to go back <laughs> to paradise. So It was so awesome so being here with, you don't mind this? No. It was so awesome being here with the, uh, in the summer, like not the rainy season. It was a huge difference, hey? hey? What'd you think? We had a blast. Are you loving it? Loving it. I saw you guys went to Mel Pais. Yeah. How are you liking yeah. that? Love it. Yeah? Love it. Loving it all. It's just That's been super, so super good. fun. So we just got home from Montezuma and the monkeys are all over my roof. I've got some great photos of them so far, but I'm going to try and get some video. I'm trying to be super quiet. There was two females on the roof with babies on their bellies. Those photos weren't perfect, but I got some great portraits. Literally portraits of monkeys. They're all over the roof. They're eating, I don't know all the leaves and stuff that we have here. I'm gonna try and get some video clips, but it's really hard. But they're so smart, they, they look right in your eyes and you can tell they know what's going on. We gave them two bananas, but they, they completely ignored the bananas. Anyway, I'll show you the roof where they are. Check it out. That's where two of them were, and that's where I grabbed some really cool portraits of them. But on the other side, over there, those trees there is, um, is kind of where the little ones are, the babies are. I'm gonna go around in a second, but I was shooting one right through here.
exactly what I wanted in a, in a portrait of, of a monkey, actually. Like, I didn't just want to take a picture of a monkey. I wanted to kind of get a portrait. But they come from these trees. they go it's kind of hard because it's dark but this is our deck and they cross right there so they're not up here right now but this is where they are they climb up those trees and they're in right in that area and that's where we see them and photograph them in there super cool So that was absolutely a super cool experience. Now I know that the little footsteps, I shouldn't say little because they're crazy loud, they'll actually wake you up. The lizard and the squirrel aren't making noise like that. That was just so awesome. It sucks that I didn't get any video clips, but I'm not going anywhere for another six months, so I'm gonna get these monkeys. But some of those photos I'm super happy with. It's exactly what I wanted to photograph of these monkeys. So cool. Anyway, off to watch the Super Bowl.